you're looking like a snack. Does that mean like I've been working out or something? <laughs> Keep the straight face. And they'd be like, yo, whoa, <laughs> whoa, yo, whoa, whoa, what's, what? And uh, they, one of the guys would be like, that don't sound like Big Snoop. And I was like, I don't know. He started like licking his lips like, you're looking like a snack. And I was, I was like, I was like, yeah, I guess I've been, you know, I've been, you know, doing my thing in the gym. Isn't that right, Big Snoop? And then I just like kind of left, and the guys, they would just be rolling laughing. Uh, <laughs> of course, I was kidding, uh, but just funny as shit because they'd be like, <laughs> one guy would like have his jaw dropped. He'd be like, you ain't supposed to be saying that's no man. <laughs> like. Oh, big Snoop, see, you know, you said it. Is a compliment? Or what does it mean exactly? Like, one guy's like, it ain't no compliment, man. <laughs> like, well, what is it? Is it an insult? And then my homie D-Block, who you guys will meet soon, I hope. We'll do a stream together. Um, D-Block could be like, yo, homie, scroll. That means he's trying to uck. <laughs> I'm like, oh, really? Oh. Uck, uck. He's like, yeah, uck. Uck your culo. <laughs> I'm like, oh. Yeah, you guys will be meeting my, hopefully meeting some of my jail friends soon. Um, I love trolling. In jail, trolling was so much fun. Um... Poops, D Block, Crispy, Dre, uh, of course, White Boy Dave. Um, you, you guys, uh, of course, White Boy Kyle. Kyle was my, my roommate. He was uh, the best. Uh, Kyle was uh, like this anorexic, skinny kid. He's like maybe 90 pounds. Redhead. I think he had done a lot of drugs, so he's got this big bald spot. But he's like 19 or like 21 or something. He's a big bald spot here. Long red hair. And then there was another dude who's, who thought Kyle looked like a snack for real. Real story. <laughs> oh, that was, that was wild. Dude, he's like an old Cuban guy. And he would like file, follow Kyle in the bathroom like this. Short, old Cuban, gay dude. And like our bathrooms didn't really have doors. So they'd have like little curtains, right? But you could kind of like, if you're really interested, you could, you could kind of see, maybe, if you wanted to. And Kyle would, not Kyle, Kyle would be taking a shit or something, but like this guy, I forgot what his fucking name was, this short little guy looking, like, trying to sneak a peek. Like, whatever gets you off, I guess, but what was that guy's name? It was like Mango or something, <laughs> something weird. Uh, but uh, yeah, he was weird. He was real weird. Um, he would tell me that he was like, he would tell everyone though. He was like, he was like next door to me in the next cube, like that he was in the Cuban cartel or something. Um, but yeah, it was, a, it was a good crew, man. Like, and when you're in prison, like it's like being in the army, except with no valor or anything, you know, it's not good for anyone. Uh, you, you like, it's your brothers in arms. Like you're really, you get really close to your friends there just cause you're going through some crazy experience. Of course, my hacker buddy who shall remain nameless, uh, coup, uh, of course, Gator, Gator from, from Alabama, Gator was the man, uh, lots of great folks, uh, I don't miss it, of course, but very, very interesting stuff, yeah, I would just try to, like, uh, come up with, uh, the best, uh, pranks, the best, uh, Stories, the best trolls I could without, you know, without crossing the line. Uh, one of the biggest things in jail is about snitches. You cannot be a snitch in prison. A lot of camaraderie, absolutely. Uh, snitch is the worst possible thing. A rat, snitch, all that stuff. Do not want to be that, right? Snitching is... So no matter what you do, no matter who you are, except for 
one sexual offenders. But even then, there's nothing worse than a snitch. And I know half y'all probably call the police. Hmm? Half y'all go to tips.fbi.gov. I bet. Snitch.gg. Chomos are worse. This is an age-old question. Is a chomo worse than a snitch? It's not clear. It's not snitching if you're a victim of a crime. Debatable. Debatable. Are you a civilian or are you in the game? Are you male or are you a female or child? Also important. A chomo snitch is low, definitely the lowest of the low. I, I think if you're a grown man and you're calling the FBI or the police, you're a snitch. This is me. Handle your own business. You feel me? Handle that. Handle that. Someone steals your car, bro, you fucked up. Right? Don't blame the hustler. You fucked up. Put the air tag on that John. Right? Maybe park your car in a better place next time. You fucked up. Don't blame the hustler. <laughs> um, the way Albanians would have had to handle it is the Albanians Hide the sheep. Hide the makin. And then, and then like 10, 20 people show up. The biggest boo dolls you've ever met. Anyway, so being a rat is the worst possible thing, right? And Apple looks like it's fairly valued. Like it's, it's almost like a... Look at it one more time. It's like a utility. I, I honestly think it's kind of risky, to be honest. Yeah, I, I kind of think it's risky. I wouldn't want to be long Apple. So anyway, um, four week T bills, 6% annualized, but they mature in four weeks, so I don't know. Yeah, it's a lot of financial stress. I think the government's the biggest problem. Get your ski mask. <laughs> Pepe, oh Jesus. I'm not long Google or OpenAI. I actually think Google's gonna be the big, biggest loser, ironically, in all of this. So anyway, um, OpenAI is a little bit weird. I have a lot of respect for the company, but a lot of people in the valley are asking if the LLM game is up, and they kind of have to migrate to apps, which I think is what Carpathy is doing. That's a really long story. If I, if you had to put a gun to my head, buy or sell OpenAI, I'd be buying at the current valuation, like 30, 30 or 40 billion, definitely a buy. But is it like that means that I'd have to have like liquidity as well. Like, so if I have to buy it for an IPO or like buy and hold it forever, I would not. But like. If you could buy OpenAI in the private markets right now, I would. Anyway, let's get back to uh, the point. Snitch GPT. <laughs> so I used to go uh, around like doing this like fake like, oh guys, like I'm the white guy. So I'm like, what did they mean when they said X, Y, Z? So one of the things they say in prison a lot is uh, Master Splinter. And it kind of comes from a Little Wayne song. Uh, and Master Splinter, if you don't know, was the rat who trained the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. But he was a rat, so it's kind of a problem. Uh, not the favorite animal of the criminal. So I'd go by, uh, I'd go by some guys, and they'd be like playing spades or something, minding their own business. They don't want to hear from me, and I'd duck in my head like this. Hey guys, you busy? What do you want, Scrawly? Guys, yeah, playing cards or whatever. I just thought, I heard something, and it was so strange, I didn't know what it meant. And I thought I'd come and ask you guys. I was talking to the boys in, uh, uh, on the yard, some of the guys from uh, Philly, and they said, Shkreli, you really that master splinter, huh? And they're laughing, and I'm like, yeah, I am like a master splinter, aren't I? And dude was like, uh, Meg from Philly, he was like, yeah, you're the biggest master splinter in all the feds, aren't you? I said, I am. I am the biggest master splinter. 
And there's one guy who's like, jaw just dropped. He's like, oh, he snitch? He snitch? <laughs> and starting to get like riled up. He's like, no, he's fucking kidding. Stop it. And be like, what? what is that? What? I'm no snitch. What is Master Splinter? Like, yo, Master Splinter, he a rat. That means you a rat. I was like, oh my God. That son of a bitch. And then another guy would be like, yo, you got to go off on him. Next time you see him, go off. And I'd be like, damn right I will. Nobody calls me a snitch. And, uh, it was a lot of fun. Uh, yeah, no, you got to swing. If somebody calls you a snitch, you got to swing. I agree. Otherwise, you're basically admitting, you know, the other phrase is you told, which is kind of like a tattle. It sounds like a kid's thing, tattletale, but it's very serious. Like somebody says, oh, he told. It's not just about, you know, who ate the uh, ice cream or the cookies. It's uh, a little more serious than that. Where you going? What you doing, kitty? You trying to play? She looks very playful right now. She's tearing up some napkins. You trying to play, kitty? No, kitty, don't eat the napkin. What you doing? You little idiot. <laughs> what a beast. What a beast. He's just gobbling up a little piece of the napkin. Kitty, what you doing? Oh, you're a beast. I'll kill it. Kill it, kitty. Kill it with fire. She's, she's so proud she ate the napkin. She tore it to shreds and then ate the napkin. What's going to happen to Sam? Sam's fucked, man. What you doing, kitty? What you doing? If Sam can get 15 or less, he'll be all right. But he ain't getting no 15 years. That man is, they're buried, they're building a jail. They're building a jail on top of the jail he's going to. He fucked up. He fucked up big time. What's up, mama? Yeah, I love you. Yes, I love you. I gotta play with this for a ball. Let's see here. Watch this. I'm gonna hide behind here. Pretend like she can't see me. Oh, oh hey! Hey, look at that! It's a little hide and seek game we play. Where is she? Where could she be? I wonder where. Where could she be? Oh! Ah, kitty, you got me! You got me! You got me! Good kitty! You got me! <laughs> um... She should be proud. Right, Kitty? Now she's hiding behind the Shake Shack bag. Look at that. She thinks she's slick. I think I hear something. What is that? Hey! It's you! Yeah, I saw the nuclear chemistry request. I, I thought I did a nuclear chemistry thing, but I might have skipped it.